I am Marie-Cécile Rouillon and uh, I'm the Commission Coordinator for the Right of the Child. So that means that within the European Commission, my task is to make sure that we give a big place to the right of the child and that when designing policies, we are sure this will also help the children. So that, that means that in developing policies, we really have to listen to the children, to their challenges, to their needs, then to develop the policy in that sense. And not the other way around of thinking what is good for children. The children are really the best place to say what is good for them. So this is really a game changer in the conception and the mindset of how to, to deal with children. And then indeed all the questions is to how to make that a reality. So that is exactly why the EU has put forward a strategy for the rights of the child. It is a strategy that the EU adopted in 2021. The key objective is really to make the right of the child a reality. The first point is really to put the child at the center, to listen to the child, to be sure that the children have the possibility to participate in the democratic life, in making their views heard. Then it is about thinking of the child in his or her environment, meaning that it has the social possibility of getting included, that it can go to school, it could have access to health. It also means that the child is protecting from any kind of violence, should it be online or offline. It is about also adapting, uh, for instance, the justice system to the needs of the children, to consider that the child is now in a totally new environment of digital environment. So in each new policy that the EU is making, now there is this effort of listening to, to the child. When talking about children, we are talking about almost 20% of the people in Europe. That's why we have put forward the European Child Guarantee, meaning that there is a commitment for children to go freely to school, to have one, one meal a day, to have access to health, including mental health, with a specific focus on the most vulnerable children, to break the circle of poverty. It's also to see at EU level how we could also um, help give funding, uh, exchange uh, policies between the member states to make sure that those children are really helped. And for all of this, it's really important that the adults understand that the children have to be hurt. And this is the case at local level. This is the case in a lot of city councils that are really inviting children and asking them to take the floor and to have their own child city council, for instance. And it's just amazing the energy and the willingness of changing the world to see how concrete they are. They are talking about school. They are talking about children who are in living in different countries. They are talking about uh, children who might be exposed to violence online. They are talking about children in Ukraine. So there is a huge curiosity and a willingness of making the life of everyone around them and of themselves better. So it is really a global challenge. It is essential to really have everyone on board, to be sure that all efforts are really going in the direction of the best interest of the child.